What's up guys, Tino here. I've been doing this video so many times, like so many different times. I've uh, redone it, edited it, you know, figured out different ways to do it. And so you already know this is going to be me talking about my favorite players for each character. But instead of going by Dr. Mario to Roy or um, just or tier list, I'm actually doing it by my tier list. So it's two in one. You guys get my tier list. And, um, yeah, I'm going to do it by top to bottom on tier. And so, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, sorry I haven't uploaded lately. I've been busy with school. Um, busy with just... I got this new TV. That's pretty cool, right? I've just been, uh, busy with a lot of things. And so, you know, you know how it is. So anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'm going to be... I don't know, just 10 minute stocks, whatever. Or actually, I'm gonna do one minute ones, so I have a, a time tracker, you know what I mean. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching, and here's uh, my list. So, first of all, uh, you have Fox, most definitely top tier. Um, and my favorite player that plays Fox is KJH, and that's because of his tech skill, um, and because I'm only doing one player for each character, or, uh, one, one player, one character sort of deal, so, like, I would have done Mango for three things, but I've only got him for one, so, yeah, uh, Fox top tier, of course, and then next, I, uh, for Marth, two things, one, uh, favorite Marth, uh, uh, favorite Marth would actually have to be, uh, let me pull it up real quick. Yeah, favorite Marth is Asin. I don't know how I forgot that. Uh, I feel Asin is very underrated for how uh, good he is. I feel he can, I don't know, I, I think he's just really, I don't know, he's really changed the Smash scene. You know, he's really made it. He's a pioneer, and he's just really good with <laughs> Marth. So, next, I have Falco. And I put Marth over Falco because of matchups. And so, anyway, favorite Falco uh, would probably be Homemade Waffles. Um, not really anything in particular, just because of his trash talking. That was dope. <laughs> but just because of his trash talking, you know. Uh, next, after that, I have Sheik. And my favorite Sheik is M2K. And M2K is just so cool with him. He's just fun to watch. Um, and he's just really good, you know. He's just solid. He's a solid Sheik. Next, I have Jigglypuff and uh, Peach. And I feel those are really tied. And I would say Jigglypuff is better, though. Just because of how defensive and um, low of a... What's it called? Low of um. A learning curve that uh, Jigglypuff has. And if you know about learning curves, like if you play Smash 4, you know you know Shulk has a really high learning curve. Uh, because of his neutral B, the, the different things. I don't know, you just have to learn new combos with him. And it's sort of the same thing with Peach, I feel. Uh, the turnip game adds a different, almost a different thing you have to watch out for. And you have to know how they react to it. It's just a lot of things, and I feel uh, Jigglypuff's easier to pick up and more reward for pick. And especially with placements, you know, Hbox being, like, really close to best. Even though Armada's best, I just feel it's like that. <clears throat> so, did I? No one won. That's cool. <laughs> okay. So, uh, another thing to note, or, uh, next character, I would say, is Captain Falcon. And now I put Captain Falcon above Ice Climbers, which Ice Climbers is next. And Ice Climbers is Wobble. Captain Falcon is S2J. But I put Ice Climber, or, uh, under Falcon. is because Falcon is just faster, and if you can't touch him, you know, he's gonna win. And I, I feel there's just more style to him. And that's why I picked S2J as well. And Wobbles is super technical, super stylish, but, like, if S2J had the tech that Wobbles had, then he would be a lot better. And I'm not saying that S2J is bad tech, 
SDJ has amazing tech, but Wobbles has even more because he needs more and to make like the same ranking, if not less. Um, next on the tier list, I would have to say Young Link, actually. And, or no, not Young Link. What am I even talking about? Uh, <laughs> what am I even talking about? Next on the tier list is Pikachu, uh, Samus, Luigi, Dr. Mario, and Yoshi. And so I think Pikachu's better than Samus just because of speed and all that. And Pikachu, my favorite Pikachu is Anther. Um, it's actually Axe, but I picked Axe for Young Link spoilers. But I picked Anther for Pikachu because that's the only Pikachu I knew. Um, and, you know, he's actually not bad. Uh, Samus, Plup, and... Yeah, Sam is pretty high up there. I just less than Pikachu because Pikachu is a super fast rundown and it's hard to beat that. It's harder to beat rundown than it is defensive. Uh, next is Luigi, Dr. Mario, Yoshi. I feel Dr. Mario, Yoshi, Luigi, um, they're all about even. I would say actually Yoshi is best. Yoshi, Dr. Mario, Luigi. But I put Luigi, Dr. Mario, Yoshi just because of the the learning curve and Luigi can know like half the tech of Yoshi and do twice as good and even if uh, Yoshi had all its tech down Luigi can still and Dr. Mario beat him consistently uh let's see yeah my favorite Luigi is Abate Abate's just super fun to watch uh, super good actually he's very underrated I feel and Dr. Mario is shrooms, one, because I don't know any others, but two, because he's actually, like, I actually think he's good, so, you know. I'm, I'm quitting that. <laughs> I'm redoing that. That was dumb. Uh, and favorite Yoshi, I would say Amza. Peanut would be my last choice for favorite. Um, out of the three that I'm about to say, Peanut, Amza, and then who I picked, Vector Man. And I said Vector Man is because he's sort of a pioneer as well. Just like Azen. Uh, I feel he's sort of a... He, he got things going. And Ken was a pioneer, definitely. All he did was dash dance, but... He was so good at the aggressive mark style. It was unbelievable. He was king. But Azen, because I like Azen. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, Vector Man. He's just super fun to watch. Um, next on the tier list, the low mid section, which I'll have the tier list in the comments, but in the low mid section, you got freaking Young Link, Ganon, Mario, Link, and Game & Watch. Now, you didn't hear Donkey Kong, he has combos, but he's a, essentially a glass cannon. So, I said Young Link, uh, my favorite Young Link is most definitely... Axe, because Axe's Young Link is just, like, uncomparable to any others. Um, sadly, uh, what's his name? Magic Scrumpy tasked Young Link, and, um, speculated that he did at least. Uh, we, I don't fully know. I, people say he did, it's almost confirmed, but then again, he just might be really good. I just noticed I chose an all uh, Pokemon team, and instead of picking Jigglypuff, I picked Young Link. Um, <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> and instead of picking, um, well, I think Random would have given me Pokemon Stadium if I picked Jigglypuff. Not anymore, but they would have. Oof. Um. Anyway. I'm going to resume. Young Link, I, I feel, is a lot better than Ganon and, um, and Mario because of his combos. He has a really good recovery. He's just all around a really good character. And then, um, so yeah, then Ganon, which I would say my favorite Ganon is uh, Bizarre Flame. The style is real. Uh, let's see. Think about what else. Uh... I would say Mario. Mario's next, by the way. Mar my favorite Mario would have to be none. Uh, one, because I use Mango already. Uh, ma like Jiggly My favorite Jigglypuff is Mango. My favorite Peach is Armada. I, I don't know if I said that or not. But 
I if I didn't then there you go. <laughs> yeah, so I already used mango and there you go. I like mangoes, uh what, what am I talking about? <laughs> I like mangoes Mario a lot, the Scorpion Master. Um but none would have to be my next in line because I like mangoes Jiggly Puff a lot more. Uh, yeah, I said Bizarro, but, um, Ganondorf. Ah, oh, I'm donezo. <laughs> then you got, for Link, I would say Sauce. Uh, Sauce is a really stylish Link. He's not for, um, uh, winning. He's more for the style. And I, that's, that's what I aspire to. Yeah, you know, I aspire to being so good. That I just care about style and I win. And he does win. He does in fact win, so not a lot. But when he does, it's it's a it's a well deserved win. So yeah. And then Game of Watch, um don't get hot headed, but Enchilada, man. Enchilada, he's very unknown, but I play with him a lot. He's a really good uh game of watch. I want him to main game watch, but he won't listen. So this is out to you, Enchilada. Main freaking Game Watch. You can keep Fox, but just go Game Watch as well. And yeah, that's that's for uh, my low mid tiers. And now for my low slash bottom tiers. Uh, low tier, I would go. It, it goes Roy, which Neo. Uh, Do Donkey Kong, which I would say West Balls. Um, Mewtwo, which sorry. Um, Zoma, but I would say Tosh. And then... Uh, Ness and Zelda. Which Ness would be H-Fox. Uh, cause... My favorite Jiggly Puffs Mango, of course. And actually, H-Fox's Ness is solid. Actually, you know, Homemade Waffles... He's just really cool. I'll just put him in as a secondary for Falco. But... Uh, Fairy Falcons, PPMD. Anyway, <laughs> so, yeah, Ness, Hbox. Zelda is the lake, because that's the only Zelda out there. But, as well, he's pretty good with them. Um, yeah, the tier list, Roy, DK, Mewtwo, Ness, Zelda. I put Roy above DK because of Roy's, um, Mewtwo, or not Mewtwo, yeah, Mewtwo King, Marth Factor, you know? It's just... He's a super solid character, other than the fact that he's super weak, but his forward smash kills at, like, 60, so I don't think he's that weak. Um, he has, very, has a lot of combo potential and all that. DK can combo, like, everyone really well, but then again, like, one hit on him and he's dead, so I feel that it's a lot harder to judge. Uh, DK. And so that's why DK is lower than Roy. And then, uh, next is Mewtwo. Mewtwo is really good. Really underrated. But, it, it's, compared to everyone else, he's rated fairly well. Uh, probably too high, actually. Um, he's very good. And he can, he has a lot of good matchups. Well, not good, but <laughs> better than, like, 80-20. And so... I respect me too, and I made him as well. I made me too and Yoshi, if you guys didn't know. Um, then Ness, Hbox. I feel Ness is above Zelda because of the combo. Uh, recovery's not shit. Or, like, it's pretty solid. Just, you have to know how to use it. You know? Um, it's like Pichu's recovery, you know? Pichu's is super gimpable. If you don't know what the hell you're doing. Uh, let's see. What else? Um, next is... Yeah, actually, next is Bowser. No, next is Pichu, actually. Um, favorite Pichu's Korean DJs. It's just super, like, Fox-like. And so, that's why I like it. Um, so... Pichu, Kirby, then Bowser. And I put Bowser as the worst, which you guys might be like, what the heck are you doing? But I feel Bowser is really the worst character in the game. Um, anyway, Pichu's, or Korean DJ's Pichu is notable. It's very good. It's like, 
M2Ks, which I, you know, there's so many things I could have put M2K, but I didn't. Oh, forgot to notice, uh, favorite Roy is Neo. Oh, I told you that, yeah. Um, okay, so KDJ. Favorite, um, Kirby is Triple R, just because there's no other Kirby that I know of, and because he's super smart. He's the same thing with Shroom. Um, plays a character that no one plays. Or, like, barely anyone. Uh, then again, and then last but not least, or actually, yeah, last but least, worst character in the game. <laughs> Day, uh, David the Bowser main. He's my, or I think that's right. David the Bowser main or something. The guy who almost got, uh, four stocked, or, uh, you know, JV'd by M2K, but he didn't, so, yeah. That's that's my favorite. Um, and sorry, DJ Nintendo, but like, he's he's just better. What? Okay, that's fair. But I hope you guys uh, get where I'm going at. I'm gonna put the tier list and. In the comments, I'll probably write out my favorite um, as well. Or not comments, but in the... What's it called? Descri description. Yeah, I'm going to put my tier list in the description as well. And my favorite listed out. So you guys don't have to watch this video. Just have to click on it. But thank you guys for watching anyway. Uh, sorry it's so long. Like 16 minutes for a tier. Um, <clears throat> I could further explain it through meta. If I get enough likes and comments, you know, if you actually want to watch it. <laughs> if you actually want to watch it, I'll, I'll go through the time to do it. But I'm not going to do that if you guys aren't going to watch. Uh, so thank you guys. I'm going to make another video soon, hopefully. I don't know what about. Probably freaking Jigglypuff or something. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. It's been fun. I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>